Hello and welcome to our channel, Theologomena. In the biblical context, when we speak about inspiration in the four Gospels, we mean something that contains the inspiration of God. And this can be interpreted by many as something that is limited only to divine revelation. Okay, many people, probably due to some rationalism, understand that this term expresses that something is flawless without any mistake perfect an absolute truth that cannot have any human element i think this idea can be a bit dangerous because when we talk about the gospel we are not talking about four books that fell from the heavens through the hand of god ready for us to read no the four gospels are the result of experience experience with Jesus, the Nazarene. Each author had his own background. Each evangelist had a certain education, his own idiosyncrasy, but Jesus was the inspiration of all. And all the writers of the Gospels were influenced by him. And most of them had direct contact with him. This one was undoubtedly at least the greatest man of all time. His teaching continues to influence countless people around the world even today. Nearly 2000 years later and many mysteries about him still remain unexplained. I realize that when we talk about the Gospels, we must know that many people tried to write about this man through pen and ink in their manuscripts on papyrus and parchment. And this man was so extraordinary that there was no other option rather than to be considered the God-man. The evangelist Luke, Paul's friend, made a great research about Jesus in order to write his gospel and explain the beginning of the Christian movement in the book Acts of Apostles. Movement that strongly impacted both the Jewish and the Greek-Roman world. We still have Mark, who write his own gospel from what was told to him by Peter, who was a disciple and lived with Jesus during his ministry who beautiful shows the messianic secret, that is, the Paulatine discovered that he was indeed the Son of God. Matthew accepted Jesus' challenge and left his profession to follow him until death. John, best friend of Jesus, who leaned his head on the heart of Jesus, shows us his deeper identity and tells us that he thinks that if all the things that Jesus did were written, not even a whole world would be enough for the written books. And indeed, the canonical gospels are a safe source, but many other external texts were written about him, many of them very early and may have at least some authentic sayings of Jesus, such as the apocryphal gospel of Thomas. As in the past, Jesus inspired the evangelists and various people, he continues to inspire us today. Irene Passin